My name is Captain Catherine Bruin. I am the HHD commander of the 472nd Chemical Battalion. As a civilian, I work as a nurse in the City of Milwaukee Office of Homeland Security to enhance emergency preparedness. The presentations you are about to view were produced on the evening of June 16, 2009 in the 128th Air Refueling Wing in preparation for Operation Red Dragon Homeland Defense Training Exercise. This exercise, which took place on June 17, 2009, was a joint federal, state, and local disaster simulation and was the largest full-scale exercise of its kind in the United States to date. This training event was hosted to increase awareness among military and civilian personnel on how to best deal with special needs populations during a mass casualty decontamination scenario. The panel was made up of local experts working within the state of Wisconsin in the areas of special needs. We realize that there are many more areas to address in the arena of special needs populations, and it is our intent to take this important first step, learn from it, and make it even better in future exercises. I would like to extend my sincere appreciation to all of the speakers and their agencies and the hard work that was done to make this event a success. I would like to specifically acknowledge Betty Corneliuson, Wisconsin Hospital Emergency Preparedness Program Region 7 Program Coordinator, Susan Vig Saucier, Assistant Professor at Carroll University, in their assistance in helping me put this together. Additionally, I would like to acknowledge the Wisconsin Department of Health Services, the Wisconsin Hospital Emergency Preparedness Program, Community Care, and Independence First for their support in providing expert speakers. And finally, I would like to thank the United States Army Reserve Commander from the 415th Chemical Brigade, General Cook, Lieutenant Colonel Murphy, Sergeant Major Di Natale, and the Red Dragon Planning Team. If you have questions after viewing these presentations, please see the contact information at the end of this DVD. I'm, I'm really, really excited about what we're doing tonight. Um, special needs and advancing, working with special needs populations is something that's really needed very much in all of our communities. And also the military need to learn how to work with special needs populations. So with me tonight, we have um, a series of eight presentations, eight PowerPoints, to give you guys some practical tips on how you can recognize a special needs patient um, and how you can best assist them through the decontamination process. Uh, as you know, decontamination is uh, scary for anybody to go through, um, but uh, helping, learning to help civilians through this process is gonna save lives ultimately.